Welcome back to my channel! Yes, alam ko. Ang tagal ko na wala. So, <laughs> pasensya na. Today, I'm gonna teach you how I do my photo shoots with my babies. <coughs> Ba't ganda boses ko? Today, I'm gonna teach you how to do my photo shoot with my... How I do my photo shoots with my babies. So, I'm um, super excited ako to show you how I do it and I'm gonna try to speak in English so that I can communicate with everyone because I think this will benefit a lot of hammy mommies and daddies out there na also want to take pictures of their um, um, hamsters and I hope I can tell you things that you haven't learned before and I hope that I can um, add more knowledge to your to your <laughs> knowledge. <laughs> so yeah. Um, after this video, I am gonna give a. Uh, I'm gonna let you know that I have a giveaway. So after this video, don't forget to stay until the end of the video so that you can also join the giveaway. So let us start. And oh oh, oh I'm sorry. I, um, I'm also gonna show you their latest. Man, meron na I'm also gonna show you their latest cage because I've already done the Christmas theme cage. So, abangan. First tip that I'm gonna give you is, guys, you have to know your hamster's favorite food or treat because that is essential. Something that they are gonna eat even there. They are outside their cages, right? So, the my hamster shell is not in tiny. They eat oats, carrots, uh, mealworms with mealworms for my rubber obviously, and chestnut, oats, kale, um, carrots. Uh, yeah, that's the first tip. Know their favorite food. Second, second tip is the best time to take your picture. So, my suggestion is before they go to sleep and after they go to sleep. Ay, before they go to sleep and after they wake up. Why? Because this is the time that they're gonna find food. Anything that will offer them is that they're gonna take it immediately because they are looking for food. So what I do, my suggestion would be I do it 6 a.m. to 7 a.m. because at that time um, the Philippines is cold um, I mean it's not so hot and there's already sun there's already light so I can do a lot of things so um, light is so important when taking pictures or taking videos um, because it's gonna give your photo a clearer um, photo to be exact or a clear video so I would suggest 6 a.m. to 7 a.m. and for rubber rub skis if you don't have um for rubber rub skis it would be better if you have a playground area or a playground box basically it's just a normal box where you can put him or her um where he can't escape and then you can put your setup inside it so yeah third tip that i'm gonna give you is already set up your decorations or your materials because once you get your hamster and once you put their food on the setup is that you're only gonna have one minute for them to eat and for them and for you to take their pictures so you're gonna have at least one minute or less for that because hamsters are so um, so energetic and they're just gonna run around do whatever so already make sure I make sure that your setup is already good to go and you're just gonna need to take your hamster inside those setup and then just take a picture and snap. So usually I do it for a minute or less than a minute. Um, it depends on how cooperative my hamster is. So yeah. The fourth tip that I'm gonna give you is to add depth to the photo. So okay. Example. <coughs> Example. Uh, I'm the object. I'm the main. Um, object of the camera so I have a background and the background is a little bit blurred because there's distance right so it adds a little a little more flair to the photo it adds a little more drama it adds a little uh, little more little more story to it so 
if you're gonna have your hammy grenade, imagine me, I imagine I'm the hamster. <laughs> A big hamster. So imagine I'm the hamster. If you're gonna have the hamster in the middle of the photo, you'd want like a lit, um, little things in the background. Like um, for this theme, I'm gonna show you. It's gonna be Christmas theme. So you want to the, have uh, you want to have like small balls at the background, so it's gonna be a bit blurry. But you know that there's a Christmas ball in the background. So. Do you understand? Do you get my drift? <laughs> Where <do you> go? <laughs> it's the fifth tip that I can give you is you can do a video instead of taking pictures. So doing videos is is easier because you can capture their moment their moments easily, right? So if you have it on video, um, <clears throat> you can just um, pick a scene from that video and then take a screenshot of it and then edit it with your editing app so that's easy so that's why i want you to do it in the morning where there is light so 6 to 7 a.m is where my hammy is done playing for the night and then he just wants to sleep but he's still awake so that time is a really good time to do it um the other thing is if you don't want to take videos, you can just do a bird shot. Um, you're gonna have like, but on your phone you're gonna have that circle at the bottom where, where you click it and then you're gonna take shots, right? So to do a bird shot, I'm, I I just need to hold it or press it long enough and then it's gonna take multiple pictures. Yeah, so. Do you get it? Um, just hold the button until it takes multiple pictures and it's like taking picture of another, of another, of another, of another picture. And then you're gonna capture it easily. Um, it, it can be a bit blurred if you're gonna do it at night. So again, that's why I suggest do it at 6 to 7 a.m. And then the sixth tip that I have for you is the last tip. Um, my suggestion for editing apps would be Lightroom. Snapseed and then you can also use your Instagram and you can have that. That's it. So let's go on to the photo shoot itself and yeah. See you there. <laughs> okay, so in the session, we built pang decorations natin for the photo shoot. So so far, mana keep a home. So makana to. 129 and then may may snowman so man to the back then ah side oh very mosquito ay bakit ba nakaano so parang gusto ko kunin itong dalawa but they mga na blue blue basket Okay, so <clears throat> the first thing that I'm going to do is set up the place. our background and then I have my balls
the food ready, the setup ready. All we need is the hamster. I think chestnut is too heavy for it. Oh no! <laughs> I think chestnut is too heavy for it. Not everything goes according to your plan, so we'll just roll with it. So let's do this instead. As you can see, it's very fast. Oh, my sweetheart. No, no more, no. He's still looking for food. So that's all the time you can have with your baby. So, sobrang bilis lang, right? So, not all photos talaga is... Um, not all photos should be according to your plan. So, you, can, you need to improvise so as you can see so um, the time frame was really a small time frame so this one is cute I'm gonna go add that to my lightroom <laughs> this one is funny so I'm gonna go add that to my lightroom ito sayang sayang to but we really need to adjust when it comes to them because we don't know what will happen. We're gonna go to Lightroom. We're gonna go check on the pictures. That is okay. So we're gonna adjust. I really like the blurred background here. And then let's contrast. Highlights, yes, yes, highlights. Less shadows and more lights. And then we're gonna use the temperature. Yes, and then then. My brands. by brands saturation content yeah. and then we're gonna go and check the details the sharpening of course we want it sharpened and we're gonna crop it to square. so we can do a square Super simple lang to have your photos. Um, actually, <clears throat> for me, um, yung setup talaga yun, the setup will bring out the photos. Let's learn how to always learn how to adapt to your hamsters because like what you saw not all hamsters can be um, cooperative so today um, the the decorations didn't really cooperate as much so I needed to be fast with it um, that's it yeah so I hope you learned something I hope you learned something new or I hope you just enjoyed the video. Um, that's it.
watching my tutorial i hope you learned something and if you do don't forget to like and subscribe like and subscribe man um yeah if you learned something and if you want me to do something i know someone suggested that i do um basic needs i think for um your first time hamster so yeah i think i'll do that and that's it and if you're gonna go to the phk christmas party Hey! <laughs> I don't know why there's an insect inside my room, but yeah. Oh, my giveaway is this one and the Santa. You you saw the Santa on my cage tour. So it is good for Siren Hamster. And all you have to do to join the giveaway is subscribe to my channel and follow Hami Wami and comment down below. In this video, um, what do you love about Christmas? That's it. And, ay ba ba? Yeah, I'll announce the winners on November 29. So, you'll have at least two weeks to join. Um, I, I'll also announce the winner in Hami Wawi's Instagram account. So, that's why I wanted to follow it. So, in case that you missed the video, is you're gonna know who's the winner there. Um, yeah, that's it. So please join guys. Just comment down below um, What do you love about Christmas? Subscribe and then follow Hami Wami and So very cute. Okay, yeah, it's really it's really cute and I want you guys to have it So I have two. I want I have a snowman and I have a Santa and I'm gonna give it to two people So that's it guys. Stay magical. Bye